<laughs> it just stuck there. I smacked it a little too hard. Maybe, uh, <laughs> Have fun. <laughs> that's just that's creepy. One of you guys chopped this rat in half, and then it kept moving. <laughs> that's a little weird. Look out, Behind we you. Nice. Good kill. My rifle's not as good as I think it was. Attack the rattling from the. The center was on. <laughs> Is that what they're calling it? <laughs> Ew. The fuck? What, I have my foot peering or something, like, right there? <laughs> okay, so... <laughs> my foot's just, like, blurred. And the watches, I guess. That's it. I can now make foot babies. So that's what foot fetishes have been after. That's their grand plan. <laughs> Alright, what do you want me to do? Let's do it. Got to mix you guys up. Oh, so even kicks to the head count. <laughs> I am Jacob, sower of chaos. Here to reap your fucking souls. Seven shotgun shots in the box. <laughs> I'll say, all right, so this, this shotgun, best shotgun I've made in the entire game. It's, it's awesome. The other shotguns I've had, trash. Oh, shit. Oh. <laughs> Bad touch. There's something else I'm supposed to do? No, just kill them all. Oh, of course, I did that. Of course, I'm always found at the most popular venues. Okay with it.
weapon. See, it used to be kind of forgiving and let you uh, still use the uh, electric weapon and just do the blade damage, not the full everything. I'll grab that shotgun ammo while I'm thinking about it. Shoot that out of the sky like Hell yeah, it is, cause... Purple. Fuck? The hell button did I press? F4, okay. <laughs> I fat fingered to F4. Put on that, cause I just dropped much faster as I ground. So that was quite chaotic, and I loved it. <laughs> That's what we like to see. Just everything destroying. All right, so I'm full up on healing. Forward make it at five. Hollywood James, and don't spare the horses. Keep getting beast with the con. Let's show them their fucking win. Kill the tweakers. Could you not stand in front of my gun, please? Hard enough to an all Down one of those to a lone badass. They fought their way right back into this fucking thing. See ya, bitch. She wouldn't want to be ya. Hell of a game, team. You did me proud. <laughs> Easy. Shoot! 
Yeah, I've seen that, uh, where you get mushroom to taste like steak and stuff. I thought about doing that when I was like, I need to cut down on red meat, but I like the taste. You know, I like how meat tastes. It's good. It loves me. Come here, you. Shit. Yeah. Fuck you guys, man. Knocked out the other guy. Uh. How's everyone doing? Hope you're all doing well. Alright, so I set my alarm for PM instead of AM by accident, and I normally wake up at 8 and then stream at 10, so we're not doing that in the PM. <laughs> but yeah, so I hope you're ready for some more cyberpunk. I literally just woke up shoved on my shirt, <laughs> so I look like ass. <laughs> I have no idea. Anyways, <laughs> let's fucking go. Looks like I have a weird... Oh, it's my hair. It's bumped up on the headset. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, what's wrong with my fucking hair? Anyways, yeah, we're, we're going to play more Cyberpunk. Today we're doing Skippy. We're going to finish him off because I don't want him in my inventory anymore. <laughs> Taking up space. Breathing up all the infantryman's air. Right, let's get over to gaming. Tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there, welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without any issues. No carjackings or drugs. All right, so we did like eight days. I have no many, no idea how many kills with Skippy. There's my kid. Better not be puking down there. Oh, you're just licking yourself. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, no, none of that. <laughs> Unless you're going to clean it yourself, you little jerk. <laughs> Speaking of cats, I haven't gone and hung out with the star in a few days. It was like yesterday and today. Because I've been mostly either sleeping or cooped up in my room and didn't really eat yesterday. And obviously I haven't eaten yet today, so I'll figure that out. Don't be like me, kids. <laughs> Remember to eat regularly. Um, so over there. Got another dry, sun-filled week. like this not listed like this I guess it's fine looks like we cleared up most of the northern area so we'll probably hit this one real quick and then swing over to this one why does it look like it's not tracking properly I'm in your way, nice city. Soak in that sun while you can. There's a cold front moving in. You 
digging the holographic clothes this one people wear. It's really interesting. Hey. Oh shit! I didn't put that much forward into it. I was already pressing back before I got that far. Stupid game. So we died in the first 20 seconds. <laughs> yeah, that'll that'll show us. that Skippy and that is worth the same amount of money. Damn, I'm, I'm over a hundred thousand. When danger lurks. Just give me the cells. I won't make them myself. What? Man, I don't have to do anything you know for you. You don't like this? Find this someone place. else. <laughs> Move. Wait. Enjoying the weather. Average temperatures this month in Night City have remained within human safety levels. Oh fuck! Within human safety levels. <laughs> It reminds me of the story of when I was a kid. There was a random bag I found underneath the bench inside a mall. And for a minute there, you know, I was like, let's do the right thing and return it to whoever owns it. And then my family, because we were very, very poor, like, I don't feel ashamed talk, telling the story, but we found a random bag under a thing full of, like, candy wrappers. Like, nothing but candy wrappers. My mom, like, saw that and... You know, because I was just going through it, because I was like, let's see whose it is. There's no ID in it, no nothing. And then she just goes, all right, well, let's throw it away, because obviously someone left it there as trash. It's just full of trash. Then I checked, like, this secret pocket on the inside or something. Like, I ended up finding, like, I don't know, $150 in cash or something like that. And uh, <laughs> we used it at Suncoast. <laughs> and I got a Gundam model. <laughs> I think I've done the model. Pretty sure that's where I got one of my gun models. Makes the most sense. Why is my car right here? Did I park here yesterday? <laughs> Alright, um. Let's see if it'll mark it now. There we go. Hey, is it? Goes back to an old friend of mine, that runner. Who's Would you home? mind if I interrupt your journey with a question? <laughs> you just did, but sure, ask away. It's an unusual request, so please forgive me. You're bad. How would you advise someone who wishes to learn more about human nature and form closer bonds? Suppose you're asking for a friend. Uh, guess you just gotta hang around them, watch, listen, study them. Study? On my ass. That is just the advice I required. A thousand thanks for your assistance. I wish you a pleasant journey. Did I do something wrong? I do. <laughs> By telling him that. First. Sorry. Tells me after a bottle and half of Joe Teal, Mike says, "Then that isn't what it seems." I ask him a question. Why do you think we're all staying with demons anyway? That's a sec. Feels like cops looking at me. Getting better at those turns. is with these people if you're gonna use your brake use your brake if you're not gonna use your brake don't use your brake but also break up oh fuck smart gun I like 
like how I said I was doing better at parent than I was. Hey V, wanna do a good deed and make some eddies while you're at it? Gotta get someone out of the tiger claws grip before they chop oh, I'm here. them into teeny tiny little pieces. You in? Deeds attached. Don't make me ask twice. A tiger claw dojo. Does that mean I can go in and beat everybody up? Sup, Benderino? Hey, you got a whole lot of nothing. I got some of these. second. Make sure I'm wearing the strongest stuff. Before I just start selling things to back up so I don't accidentally. Damn. What do I need? Level 20. Almost there. I don't want to keep that. I want to see what it looks like. Shit, I didn't mean to do that. I was hoping to walk in the door and go like, there's no mercy in this dojo. Right, Just beat everybody up. You get one freebie a lot of times, I'm noticing. Damn. <laughs> 
That was quick. Oh, I can't brute strength this like I normally can? Oh, that's lame. You row? Yup. <laughs> That's me. Was hired to get you out of here. Can you walk? Girl, I've got 43 fights under my belt. This isn't my first black and blue makeover. Say the word, and I'm right behind you. Give me one sec. Be right back. Me loot. Me loot. Okay, then get up. Time to turn. Automated transcript. Where is Coolidge? Inside. Inside where? Your mom. You're fucking funny. <laughs> I'll ask you again. Where the fuck is he? Hold on. I have to. I have to check. Yeah, he's still in your mom. <laughs> That's it. Not so funny now, huh? Let's talk. Where's Coolidge? And not another word about my mom. Okay, okay, I'm done. Smart move, so... He's in your other hole now. <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> and tail. With you all the way. Listen, if we run into trouble, I can't help you. At least, not in this state. I'll handle it. That's what I'm paid for. <laughs> The human body holds between five and seven inches of blood. You fucker! Damn, dude, these people hit hard. It was like three bullets and I was down. Yeah, one, two, three. Yeah. All right, well now we got a swift way in. Kinda cool that he's named Wolf.
Are you Ro? I like that it won't let yep. me loot. That's me. Unless I was hired to get you out of here. Basically. Can you walk? Girl, I've got 43 fights under my belt. This isn't my first black and blue makeover. Say the word, and I'm right behind you. Okay, then get up. Time to turn tail. With you all the way. Listen, if we don't into trouble, I can't help you. At least not in this state. I'll handle it. It's what I'm paid for. Yeah, I bet you thought. Doing? Why does he just keep sitting there? One moron. All over there we now. Go, dummy. You better Delta. Let's put this whole thing to rest. My car? That's not my car. A little bit faster, Wimpy. Yeah, he's bleeding out his fucking legs. Thanks. Real I, bad. I think I can take it from here. Like, sure you will. In the vehicle? Hey, listen. By the way, who threw down the eddies to bust me out? I don't know if it's this name, but... Masadu. Knew you'd be in a bit of a fix after the stunt he pulled. Huh. Just like him to do that. First he lends me knee-deep in shit, then tries to pull me out. I don't know if I should spit in his face or shake his hand when I see him now. It'd be better for both of you if you never saw each other again. Ever. You're on the level. Don't let this city swallow you up. And if it does, make sure it remembers you. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm gonna be telling me. Sig reached me that role secured. Can't say I'm not impressed. You handled it like a real pro, closing the gig, sending the eds. Of course I'm a real pro. Who do you think I am?
Eh, yeah, right here's fine then. Oh, okay, collecting it like that. Finally! Some real action! You magazine detect. No message. Currently in the past. That thing is just not doing what it needs to do. are missing like if you suspect ah, come on move why am I walking I must be out of stamina or something look at that ball run Where are you going? Checking a dude missing a head. <laughs> oh, a couple of people missing their head. A lot of dead bodies over here, man. Maybe, uh, Fun don't fact. do drugs, that'll kill you. The vast majority of murders are committed by men. You go, girl. <laughs> Actually, you know what? I want to stop at the Ripper Dock and swap two Gorilla Arms now. Maybe Mantis. How much does my Katana do? 290. We'll see how much Mantis Arms does. I think the Dock should be around here a little bit too many. Yeah. in it. I guess I'll do it. <laughs> oh, this one's front wheel drive. That's why it feels weird.
I didn't even touch her. She just dived onto the ground. Magazine detected. Message to user. Thanks, Choom. What? What am I getting hit? Certificate of Participation presented to Victor Vector. Second place, heavyweight class. Fourth opening finals. Watson Boxing Grand Prix. Harriet Bonner, organizer. Keishan Roberts, NB NCBA president. April's 3, 2061. Uh, it's like 17 now. What was that, 16 years ago or something like that? Alright. I need parts, Doc. Yeah, we'll grab that. Yeah, more stuff to pick up. Hands, I still got the best one. Man, I really wish the projectile launcher was good. Even the mono wire doesn't feel that good. They look the same. Aw, lame. I guess the mod that's supposed to let you actually get um, customized arms and stuff didn't work. It's probably that it was out of date or something. I'll double check it. I was wondering why it keeps looking wrong. Like a lot of the new arms are like kind of lame. Like the mono Ireland one just looked like my regular arms. Sir Eduardo, or whatever his name was. I'm pretty sure it was Ed. Who are you? Random Netrunner. But then what, you ask? Reptilians! You can recognize them by their cold blue eyes. Creatures born centuries ago on the Antarctic ice sheet. They hide their true faces under masks of human skin! You know, Toothpaste lizards don't like oppressors of humanity! Reset so I can hear them. 
Want to hear the spiel? You can recognize them by their cold blue eyes. Creatures born centuries ago on the Antarctic ice sheet. They hide their true faces under masks of human skin. Two-faced snakes, oppressors of humanity! If it's such a big giveaway, won't they just install optics or use contact lenses at least? If it were only so simple, they are reptiles. Their nervous system isn't compatible with human cybernetics. Then why not have their own rippers invent some? Are you sure they haven't already? I like that. And That's where did this filth slither out from, you ask? Antarctica. You said that already. Today they hide amidst the snow and ice of the South Pole. Step by step, usurping our crown as creation's chosen. Millions of years ago, they evolved from dinosaurs to become the world's first advanced, intelligent race. And who is their progenitor? Their masters? The scientists of Alpha Centauri! Oh, yeah, Alpha Centauri. I recognize you. You come here often. Your eyes tell me that your mind has opened to the truth. Will you provide a humble donation? so that I may continue my mission. You do good work. Use this to wake Night City up. I like that Thank you, like you this for your devotion. Give people the money. I saw a disciple of truth in you, you from go. the very beginning. Like giving. Gesture controls can be fun. If All right. You turn a line yeah, well, I had to make feel. They have already won. Oh, okay, now we just do a random spiels. Not like a whole thing. See, now there's two more up here. Are we sure they aren't randomly generated at this point? Like, seriously, it feels like it. Like you'll never run out of missions, technically. Get a job! Stop scaring me! Get a job, Gary. Jumped in the road. Yeah, that's what I mean. not my fault. Oh, wait, that's not my turn. Next one. Watch it, bitch. Fuck shit, get hit. Alright. <laughs> Shoot those dogs! Oh, I think they know I'm here. That's a break contact first. Oh, 
think they're shooting at me. My nails are gone. Aw, lame. I really like my nails. Those would make sense. You don't want to crack a nail while you're decking someone with, like, the strength of a gorilla. <laughs> for punching that lady out, but she shouldn't have talked shit. <laughs> oh, those aren't, uh, ladders. <laughs> kind of reminds me of air gear. Oh, he fucking did the double jump before I even jumped the first time. What the hell? Man, that's stupid. Here, we'll do that. Really? Stupid. See, and he keeps doing the double jump as the first jump. I don't, I don't understand. Everyone hears that. Okay. That's all right. Alright, kill me. That was just that was just a uh a thing I was thinking about. Just a simulation I was running into.
zweimal drei Spot kommt schon mal zu. Oh man, he is never getting out now. Giving me options to hack the damn thing. There we go. Oh, that was the wrong one. There was a camera right here. Are you happy with the autonomous shooting function? Please jump to confirm. It's not actually finding me, so as long as I don't move, I'm good. For now. What the hell's on my ground?
<laughs> Punching nothing. Oh, that's what she was doing. That's nice. That's beautiful. <laughs> Good throat punch. Everyone doubts the throat punch till it happens. Shit sucks. Come out. Let's solve this like war. Oh, I literally punched that off. Person I'm supposed to be finding, right? She looks like a wife. Yeah, she's alive though. That's what that's to be. That's her. Okay, notes. Day one, Lauren arrived. Good physical condition. Refuses to talk. Aggressive tendencies. Cries often. Lauren bit Kenji. Recorded voice sent with stills to Bradley. Physical condition worsened. Lost weight, much weaker. Uh, Lauren began refusing food. Began nutrition, nutrient drip. Uh, now willing to eat kanji. Physical condition, average. Began refusing to eat. Are you Lauren? You want something? I'm getting you out of here. What? Your husband hired me. I'll make sure you're safe. Stupid, fucking worthless piece of shit! There, there. You gotta help me, I'm begging you. That's why I'm here. Come on now, let's get up. I'm guessing she means something else. Head down. Bro, she's aggressive as ball. She's ready to, like, kill someone. Transport is already arranged. Good thing I didn't hide all those bodies.
for now. All over now. Better Delta. Yeah, the way she got up and just started sprinting towards the enemy, I was just like, oh damn, <laughs> she is aggressive. Want something? Getting you out of here. I'm getting you out of here. W what? Your husband hired me. I'll make sure you're safe. Stupid, fucking worthless piece of shit! <laughs> Come on now, we need to go. Head down. Talk to her after the fight, then, real quick. Oh, guess there aren't dudes this time. Still trying to figure out the rules of that. None of it still makes sense. <sighs> 55, 1C, Not so bad. All over now. You better Delta. Now there's no option to actually talk to her, I guess. Oh, okay. Is there someone who can help you? Um, my mom? Tell her to lay low somewhere. They'll be looking for your family, friends. You understand? Y yeah. Oh, wh what about Brad? Just focus on yourself right now. Hey, see that car? It'll take you someplace safe. Th thank you. Look out for yourself. Welcome, buddy. At least all the side missions feel unique. You know what I mean? Like, they're not constantly, like, do the same exact thing you just did 20 minutes ago. But in this other place, you know. Lauren is secure. 
I'm informing Bradley now. Thank you for your help. Contact closed. This is what I mean. Like, I cleared all this area and now it's back, so. I don't know. Eventually they gotta run out, right? <laughs> Maybe some unlock level based. The good thing is, I don't feel like I'm uh, missing content or locked down because of my level or something, because I didn't get so far in the campaign and stuff like other games like to do. I hate that shit. Because, like, I want to be able to do everything, but I want to do it at my own pace. I don't want to have to do half the campaign before I get full freedom of, like, let's say Night City. Like, if it were to lock me down in one area. <clears throat> Until you do, like, 30% of the campaign, that would suck. Speeding up as I speed up. Fuck you. <laughs> I love people that do that in real life, by the way. When, you, when you're like, alright, I want to move over or just exist in your own lane. And then suddenly they speed up as you speed up or they slow down as you slow down. They're like, they aren't competing, but they're trying to like hold their position for some reason, even though you have nothing to do with them. There was this dude. I, uh,. I was driving around um, near our local Walmart, and it's a 45 near there. And uh, I was going 45, and the guy next to me was driving 30, and I moved into the other lane, then started, like, hit the cruise control at 45. And then he started speeding up, and then I was like, you know what, let's see, I'm gonna go to 50 real quick. For like two seconds, I go to 50. He sped up to there. I slowed down to 30. He slowed down to 30. And then when we get to the stoplight, I'm just looking at him like, what the fuck are you doing? And he just looked like he was coked out of his mind. So it's like he was trying to use me as a gauge in order to like stay the right speed. <laughs> you want a piece of this? Uh. <laughs> One shot him. Like a predator over here. <laughs> Giggling. Hello, user. I have prepared a usage data report for you. Please say anything to continue. All right, show me what you got. User, I have assisted you in maiming over 50 people. To help me improve your experience, please answer the following survey question. Why do you prefer to maim rather than kill your enemies? No. Thank you. Initiating stone cold killer mode. I will now aim exclusively for the head. No, 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 wait. I'm so glad I could be of assistance. Huh. Where is he? Sounds like he's close. Is he up there? I think they're up. There you go. 
Alright, time to be a Batman for this person. Also, now that we got Stone Cold Killer, let's see if this thing can actually kill somebody. It's not being so fucking useless. Like, cause when you're not even good at naming people, what's the point? Pretty sure they're not up here. I'm pretty sure they were down there. Hook! <laughs> <sighs> That's how Batman would work in real life. Just <laughs> straight fall and smash his back and legs. <laughs> I tried to PLF, but it didn't work. <laughs> hmm. Alright. I'm guessing it was just a glitch. It sounded like the joke. I like the way the doors open this. Like, if I ever build my own car from scratch, that's the kind of thing I want to do. Like, DeLorean, but not wings, because you never have enough room to open them damn things. I think that's gonna be one project I do by the end of my life is build like my own car of some kind. Hello! Is anybody hey. there? Quickie! Mount the car of the Lorian van. They're holding it in one of their hideouts. Address I have. Just seem to be doing a little bit more damage. Shot from that van. Mm, yeah. Other words, you're Don't clepping stop. for the cleppers. <laughs> Need more info? Scan the attachment. Fight and die! Fight and die! I think it ain't my car. Or else I'd be pissed. Did not ping them properly. Come on! I'll oh, be your goes. friend! There it goes. I only have to try it like three times. Well, 
So I was right about where the sniper was. Can't hide. You know I thought that. I was wrong because I didn't see him immediately. That it didn't let me grab it. Uh, fuck. I fully had him, and the game just like, nah. <laughs> Son of a bitch. <sighs> Come on, show yourself! You are a pirate. You're hard to do. Uh. Do what you want to fire this Harry Lyon and Andre Allen. Harry. Got the target. In the truck we jacked. There's some kind of data carrier. Who knows what it is. Can't connect to the piece of shit. Could you send someone over to take a look? Now is not a good time. All my people are occupado. Maybe someone in the Totentans has a second? I'll ask around. Just got word. No can do. Just take it for now. And deal with it later. Come on, Fuck you, let's see that pretty face. Come on, go to it. 
shit. Threat detector must have been on the fritz. That's not what I thought. <laughs> I thought this would distract for some reason. My brain, because I'm like, it's always the third one. So if I come from the other side, I should be able to choke them both. What the hell? Oh, fuck it, eh? Like, I need to get away. Uh. Alright, so note to self. Stop landing right next to enemies and trying to get that choke immediately. It doesn't work. <laughs> it's not consistent, I should say. Like, in real life, it'd be easy peasy. Like, just murking all these dudes would take, like, two minutes max. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay, so this is straight after I buried that guy in the dumpster. Grab the outside guys first before I work my way in. Just like real life. Your camera. There you are. What the fuck? Kind of looks like a Hemet, like a future version of a Hemet. Urgent reply needed. Dear sir or madam, my name is San San Dawes or something, and I work for Wet and whatever that is. I found the address on the client list for Z Zeta Tech's Dutch office. Your name happens to be identical to that of a former client who died tragically in the recent floods ravaging the north uh, north of Europe. Please excuse the rather informal nature of this email, but the matter is truly urgent. My client has left behind 10.7 billion in cash. In accordance with local law, the government will assume the entire sum if an error is not found within a week. I also have it from unofficial sources that the funds will be earmarked for the local branch of Europe uh, business machines, which uh, plans to take over Amsterdam. But we can stop them if uh, you are not related. Oh wait, we can stop them. I know you're not related to my client by blood, but by taking advantage of a few legal loopholes, we could inherit his fortune and split it three ways. 40% for you, 40% for me, and 20% for the remaining... 20% uh, for the flood victims, of course. 
Uh, please respond to this message within three days. Otherwise, I will have to look elsewhere for help. Sincerely, that guy. I'm glad they moved on. Stars, your name, and well, so the same exact thing twice, really. That's funny. <laughs> I am a prince. <laughs> I'm a Saudi prince, and I have all this money. <laughs> all the bodies hidden so it'll help my uh, ninja stuff. Pick up. So you get that iron yet? Why the fuck are you avoiding my calls? Boss, everything's peachy. We're trying to lay low and keep quiet. You'll get all the gear first thing tomorrow. Need someone to watch your back? Animals. Shot out of his ears. Oh, I said I was soft. Can't hide. Just you shut know the that. fuck up and cut. Alright, so now he physically shouldn't be able to see me. Oh, wait, but that can. Nothing in here? I suppose I could bring him out of here to that one. Oh, actually, I could bring him both here. I just like that you level your ninjutsu. <laughs> <sighs> Conversation between Todd and Either Jillian or Gillian. Hey, gotta gotta cover a friend and do a run for Malorian. Then going out with the boys for a drink after? Or going out for a, a drink after the gear's delivered? Would you look at that? How nice of you to give me a heads up. For example, Gil can't s see you tonight. Uh, Gil, I'd rather hang out with the boys. I'm just fucking thrilled. I messaged you before. Messaged you before, don't you remember? 
Sending you a still of our convo. Found well, not found. Why do you treat me like this? Obviously, your friends are more important. Honey, please. Uh, I can't go see my friends too, and not say anything. So, what do you want to want me to do? It's fine. Go. I already have plans. Jesus fucking Christ. That's right. Keep swearing like your father. That's it. I'm out. Bye. Funny that he's still looking at a uh, closed window. Let me grab that. Oh, <laughs> it didn't work for like no reason. Corporate Wars, the musical, absolutely phenomenal. Ziggy Q, true to art and history. Karina Lee, there were many explosions. Gil Jordan <laughs> and 54 News. Uh, Act 1. The fourth corporate war is underway. Saburo Arasaka is displeased with the progress of his son. Uh, what do we say? K? K? I'm just going to call him K from now on. Uh, who is commanding Arasaka's forces. He instructs K to defeat the enemy in order to prove himself as a worthy successor. Uh, and... Where was I? Worthy successor. K desires, above all, to gain acceptance and pride of his cruel outbreak uh, squarely on... Wait, what? K desires, above all, to gain acceptance and pride of his cruel father. So he devises a scheme to place all blame of the war's outbreak squarely on Militech. Their conversation is overheard by Sarah, a Militech agent, and also the beloved adoptive daughter of General Donald uh, Lundy. Sarah concludes that the only way to quickly end the blood of bloody conflict is to assassinate Kay. General Lundy comforts his daughter and gives her courage. Soon, Andrew. A young idealist and idolater? Idolater? I think it's idolater. Of Saburo arrives in Night City. His dream is to find the last living seagull in the world, so he attempts to stow away aboard a uh, Arasaka ship. Then he discovered Then he is discovered apprehended and mocked by Arasaka security personnel. Meanwhile, Sarah is preparing her ambush against Kay, who is due to inspect the ship the very same day. When her target appears, Sarah is poised to fire her gun, when suddenly her eyes lock with Andrew's 
Um, time stops. Sparks fly. Young love is born. After a moment, Sarah shakes free of her daze and fires a K. She miss. Sorry, she misses. Andrew then intervenes, shielding K with his own body. The Militech agents uh, must flee the scene. K had noticed the twinkle in the eyes of the young lovers when their eyes met. Under the guise of gratitude for saving his life, he decides to use Andrew as bait in a trap for Sarah. He orders his scientist to heal the young man's gunshot wound and secretly install a synthetic heart containing a nuclear bomb. Jesus. He formally accepts the young, uh, grateful man into the Arasaka Armed Forces, and knowing Andrew's reason for stowing away, he convinces him that Militech is responsible for the destruction of the marine ecosystem and seagull population. That's pretty crappy. Why is this all three acts? Or just act two? Okay. Act two. Sarah returns to General Lundy after failing her mission. With a father's love, he is able to forgive her, comfort her, and offer her a chance at redemption. He assigns Sarah to lead the charge on Arasaka Tower and end this nightmarish war for good. Still smitten from the brief encounter, Sarah and Andrew simultaneously come up with the same plan to search for other for the other in cyberspace. By chance, they find each other at the virtual coral reef. At first, they are overwhelmed with unbridled passion of new love, but quickly realize um, they can never be together. Andrew er erroneously accuses Militech of destroying the original Coral Reef, causing Sarah to realize that her beloved had become a member of Arasaka's security forces. Both corporations are preparing for the final confrontation. Andrew and Sarah mourn their unrequited love, General Lundy worries over the risk his soldiers face. Uh, Sabro reminds his son that he has only one more chance to earn his father's pride and respect. Kay has come to the conclusion that the, his victory cannot be assured, so he decided decides instead to blow up Arasaka Tower and pin the blame on Militech in the hopes of earning his father's love and death. Sarah's unit enters Arasaka Tower. The two lovers meet as battle rages on around them, but neither can bring themselves to harm the other. Kay attempts to detonate the bomb in Andrew's heart, but mm, the detonator fails. Struck with a nefarious idea, Kay instead shoots Sarah, killing her on the spot. Andrew's heart breaks with grief, causing the bomb inside to detonate. Jeez. In the moment before the explosion, Andrew gazes up into the sky and witnesses a seagull soaring overhead. Nucle nuclear bomb explodes, destroying the tower. Young man, the seagull, and his dreams. Oh, that's fucked up. <laughs> hey, there's a seagull. And then your nuke fucking kills it. <laughs> fucking cooks it on the spot. Andrew's Lament. I dreamed of a dream. Of an endless sea. Arasaka at the helm. Today my dreams are nothing but mist. And I, I'm nothing but down. My eyes wish never to see again, covered in a seafoam veil of gray. I now see only the black abyss, my chrome heart gnarled in pain. Arasaka Corp bought my soul in exchange for blood and mourn. The strength in me has forever died, and a corporate corporal rat was born. That's all well and good.
fuck. <laughs> and now stop working. What the hell is all of this thing? Shit. I broke it. Last save. just before I looked at it so it ain't busted hey look it works okay Villifer Columbus log in for Columbus property uh, down. nothing important <laughs> Data bank. for the shard. Sure it'll come in handy. Gig closed. Scabs. We hate scabs. Get to know Royal! Bum bum be dum bum bum be dum bum. Kill scavs on sight. It's my general rule. That's how you live a long, happy life in Night City. The fact that the colors are so close too is kind of annoying. <laughs> like, I'm glad I'm not colorblind, or this would be even harder to gag myself to places. Just like in real life, back. It's raining, it does get kind of hard. <laughs> 
in night vision. Because the water uh, reflects the light and it's amplified in night vision. It's really neat. Did my car just explode? I mean, it wasn't my car, but still. Seriously? <sighs> Those bastards. <sighs> She got executed. Hey, you're free now. Good. Man, what do you lock yourself in there and just live in there? Like no door in. All right. Well, I hope you're good. Digitrek? No, dig Digitalk. Need a... V. Guy named Max Jones needs help. He might disagree, but if you don't get to this stubborn gaunt first, he's as good as dead. Max is a media and a good friend of mine. Need you to bring him to me. If he puts up a fight, you're clear to use force. Like I said, he's stubborn. Deets attached. Got something to ping off him. There we go. Ah, damn, dude. Just got fucking tripwire claymores and shit. Credits, outro. Nelly Bly, all these names. Archive, world news, services, no service. Uh, it's 7 p.m. on 6th of June, 2017. And I'm Nelly. <coughs> Nelly Bly. Coming to you live from the World News Service. Today's biggest stories include further casualties from the war as Sacramento was carpet bombed last night. The USSR has also sent humanitarian aid to Night City. <clears throat> hmm. Independent observers claim that it's, quote, not humanitarian aid, only trucks full of weapons. <laughs> the Free States of Texas has officially closed its borders to refugees from Night City. It's 7 p.m. on the 24th of October, 2074, and I'm Nellie Bly, coming to you live from the World News Service. Major stories today include a cyber psycho attack in Kabuki in which three people have died. An earthquake in Italy has killed an estimated 98 people. President Myers has offered uh, to help protect night citizens with Militech forces, though her words were sharply criticized by Night City Police Commissioner. Bye. 
Can I rearm this? Oh, I can't. Okay. We're barely out of the ICU when they roll up. Cameras scrolling, fresh footage. The false rumors circling Busan. Conspiracy theorists have recently been roused by the news of alleged human activity uh, in the ghost city of Busan. Our younger readers may not recall that the Korean city, formerly 4 million strong, was wiped off the face of the earth during the Fourth Corp War. Unofficial sources out there point the finger at Militech, whose tendencies of tyranny led <coughs> to the creation and spread of lab-grown deadly virus. Accident, experiment, whatever the truth, the virus proved so virulent that the United Korean government still won't lift the strict quarantine on Busan and, and all these decades later. I wonder if this is a reference to Train to Busan. Like, if you ever watch that movie, it's great. Uh, the f so, why did all these tabloid junkies and sensation seekers all all of a sudden become so interested in the dead city again 50 years later. A soul base uh, detective unearthed satellite image showing signs of life, well, technical life, that is, in the form of active machinery, but no real surprise there. After all, Busan was one of the mo world's most heavily automated uh, metropolises. It was a human virus, not the computer variety. Many of the robots go about their work, their repairs, their trash scooping, and sorting. These mystery sat images, just some computer that never got turned off, that's it. The people of the United Korea uh, can sleep easy tonight knowing Busan is a ghost town in the metaphorical sense only. Faces on TV told us what to say and wanted to show people how much they care about vets. The show and blood was <laughs> That's right. They gave us Nova implants and pre-med care. Even the big cats on the board showed up. I'm guessing he's another veteran. Having a hard time. Laggy spot. I was wondering if we were giving double XP that way. <laughs> like head height just rude <laughs> then they packed up their cameras and forgot all about you yeah hey. this those implants we had to get back these first gen pieces of garbage
Okay, so I don't get anything for doing it remotely. So let me do it physically. There we go. Now I got the one. Fuck. I wasn't even close with it. The gun must have fucking set it off. God damn. Shit out of me, though. <laughs> oh, okay, so just in case people come from different directions and stuff. Wait, where's my... Fuck. You a corporal? Hey, man. Tell me, or I shoot. Yes. Max, drop that iron. Let's talk. No, you assholes won't take me alive. Mind if I save scum? I didn't know that was a thing. All right. I am a corpo. That sounds like I don't know what to answer. I guess just saying his name would weird out a conspiracy theorist. You a corpo? Tell me, or I shoot. Not a fucking suit. Name's V. Regina sent me. Regina. <laughs> Stop throwing away the damn heavy Tell machine her she gun, can get dick. Fucked. Also stand up straight. Motherfucker. I got that loaded. loaded. Oh, that's dark. <laughs> I like that. Inside Metacorp, we associate nomads with chaos, societal collapse, technological backwardsness. And for good reason. But there are always exceptions to the rule for no for the nomads. That exception are the meta. More specifically, Metacorp. Unlike other nomad groups that deal with smuggling and raiding, the Meta are strictly law-abiding. Metacorp, formerly registered in the Western corporate states, is a majority uh, stakeholder in numerous shipping companies, including the rapidly growing DTR, Deckard, Tanaka, and Rogers, which handled 53% of all of America's transports last year. The story of Metacorp is the story of American entrepreneurship, Oh, sorry, entrepreneurial spirit and confidence in the future. Two things that not every, not even a nuclear war would destroy. Indeed, Metacorp only proves that a new order can rise out of out of entropy. That the rustle of euro dollars is capable of civilizing e even the most savage barbarians. Last month, I had an opportunity to visit the company's headquarters in Medici. The mobile island currently anchored in the Gulf of Mexico. There I met Victoria Meta, the corporation's nomad CEO and granddaughter of the Metacorp's founder, Jonathan Meta. Victoria had clearly inherited his steely gaze and enterprising spirit. Sorry, mind. Why are you starting to kill yourself? Heard your interview on the way up. Started broadcasting the moment you showed up on the feed. It wasn't finished, not like I wanted it, but uh, 
At least people got the truth. So why are you starting to kill yourself? Why the suicide threats, huh? Thought you were a corpo. Sent to silence me. So you would have died anyway. But on my own terms. The bastards control I everything. But me, I get to decide when I go. I do. Tell Regina that too. Not gonna break. Not like her. Let me loot all of this. Then we can talk all you want. You always take this. Flat am worse. <clears throat> As a direct result of the armed conflicts of the U.S. soil from the early 90s until 20s uh, or 2000s, Latin America, comprising South and Central America, remodeled itself in a, into a strong federation of independent nations, bound through m mutual aid and cooperation. The U.S.'s military presence was forced from Latin American territories, with the exception of Panama, where it stood its ground despite fierce pressure from guerrilla forces. Good job, Panama. Many researchers and contemporary historians maintain that, in fact, the Latin American wars uh, were responsible for the U.S.'s eventual collapse, breaking up the gang of four uh, CIA, FBI, DEA, and the NSA, and decimating the U.S. Army. However, it's important to bear in mind that no external conflict could have toppled the colossus of American imperialism were it not already built on clay foundation. Long to make up your mind? There's a death warrant out for you, but you probably already knew that. Uh-huh. Yeah, I could give a shit too, but Regina wants to help you out. Help me out? She's the one who needs help. Oh wait, no, this is a different one. She was Max. the best media I knew. Shit, she was my mentor. And now, <laughs> sold right out. But I won't be bought. Not me. Do not ignore this message. Max, a job just came through and there's a very big price on your head. Somebody's already took it. Come on, this don't isn't a have fucking joke. You could be killed. Let me help you. Come to my place and I'll give you some somewhere to hide until things quiet down. And listen, I know you still have a grudge against me, not without good reason, but the time has come to put all of that aside, okay? Above all else, we're friends. Come on, Even don't if have our lives day. went in different directions, I remember, we have more in common and I don't just mean our last names. Oh yeah, they are both Jones, uh, than you think. Max, I'm begging you. Pick up the hollow. Something to chew on. Hello, I'm contacting you about the matter uh, that might be of interest to you concerning uh, war veterans. I have evidence that the in blood we serve. You always take this long uh, to make up your mind. Nothing but a clever uh, gimmick. The campaign's main goal was to help veterans, and indeed they were given help, but only temporarily. Allow me to explain. Soldiers who lost their limbs while in active duty were chipped with cream tear implants. The problem was that after six months, they had to give them back to the corporation. Their veterans allowance, which was meant to last indefinitely, was also taken away. I have proof of all this. Documents still, etc. I can also put you in touch with the veterans involved. I'll send it all on in 48 hours sounds interesting why me and why do you want this information to come to light what's in it for you we had an interview once you're an honest honest vulture I know it as for reasons let's just come say on, I have, have all day. I have them and leave it at that I'd rather focus on what I'm telling you is true and that good people were exploited Tomorrow, I'll start transferring the files on the blood we on the in blood we serve program. All right. She was your mentor. Regina was your mentor. Not just mine. She was the best war reporter in Night City. Then she turned fixer. 
Yeah, like I said, sold out. Things used to be different. The media's word fucking meant something. We tracked those sons of bitches every dirty move. Now, you can prove Halt's in Arasaka's oh, pocket. And nobody gives a flying fuck. turd fuck. <laughs> So why are you still reporting? So why do that veteran piece if we're all so fresh out of fucks to give? So that people start asking questions? Start wondering? Just like you, now. Maybe that little grain of discomfort will grow into dissent. Who knows? I figure it's worth a try. Ease her out, fixes her in. You dying wouldn't change a thing. Come on, let's go. You go the way of the gonk here, won't change a thing. Running won't change anything either. I'll manage without your help. This all out of spite for Regina? You got something to prove to her? <laughs> you don't know Jack. Starting to Okay, you're starting to bit. bore me. Let's go. I'm not going anywhere. Then I'll make you. <laughs> Good luck. She deserves a chance. You got an itch for Just the truth, her. don't you? If you want to know who Regina is now, what she really fights for, just go and see her. Mm -hmm. At the very least, it didn't mean a lot to her. Max? I'll talk to her, but that's it. I was about to grab that's and choke him. <laughs> okay, just gotta download a few things. Do what you gotta do. This room. I swear I'm hearing scuffling and shit. Come on, Max. Let's go. Fucking hey, dude. So annoying. It's still doing it? Even outside? Synth cigars. No time to waste. Let's go. Take care, Max. Yeah, you too. Yeah, I didn't kill him.
do is I need to shoot. Oh, you can't run while holding that. You can walk though. Yeah, buddy. Here, all yours. Why oh, so good and you? God bless. Time, buddy. Wish I could afford to do that in real life. Entrance that place or the side entrance, whatever. They are. Damn, it actually like, guarantees blows them apart. That's gonna be damn. Oh wait, this is that spot I came to before in the game and I got my ass kicked because I was very under leveled. Uh, uh, yes. Uh, yes. Uh, what must I do? Oh, dear, you are blind! I'm like, guys, I'm like, guys, I'm like, guys, I'm like, guys, game. <laughs> Area sanitized. <laughs> Conversation between Vlad and Yelena. If I were you, I wouldn't do biz with Falter and his chums. They're pigs. Can't be trusted. I know. So far, so far he's playing nice. Plus he paid. So this is happening. Have your way. I'm rounding up the muscle and heading your way. Good. You 100% sure we won't get ambushed? No. But worst case scenario is we just lose them.
Oh wait, the sniper. I forgot that blue. Unless this body flew down here. <laughs> Guessing that was their body. Any version of this, but where I can run with it. <laughs> Damn it. Oh, those are the real guys I was looking for, aren't they? Eh, maybe not. But they're gonna die all the same. Dog, it's been there. Over here! Targets are living naked. Here, because I walked in here. I'm guessing this one place like freed up. So this is the Totentan's place. Let's just see what happens. Let's see if I get my shit pushed in. be a place to get into a fight later or something fun. Oh, it's a band. Uh, not band, uh, bar.
Rewiring Synaptic Pathways, Chapter 1, The Future of Neurotechnology. The 21st century heralded a worldwide revolution in neurotechnology. We as a, as a society can no longer imagine a world, sorry, an existence without technology, heightened, heightened senses, enhanced memory capacity, and pain modulators. By linking our neural systems to, with computer chips, we are capable of learning complex skill sets in seconds, the subsequently forgetting them again the instant they are removed. Uh, today, after nearly 80 years of increasingly incorporated, inco incorporating these technologies into our daily lives, we must now ask ourselves what comes next. In recent years, the academic community has reignited the discussions on possible new methods to influence brain plasticity um, is it possible to create permanent neural pathways using coprocessors? Can we expect a breakthrough regarding uh, dopa uh, minergic data manipulation in our lifetime? If so, what will be the consequences? The probable emergence of commercially viable artificial neurotransmitters would undoubtedly reshape the health science field. Yet. Would simultaneously reintroduce, uh, sorry, introduce a potentially destructive tool to most governments and corporations. The field of plasticity uh, manipulation remains in its infancy, but most experts agree we should be prepared, or we should prepare for the, a future in which neuro uh, neurological rewiring will become as commonplace as cybernetic implants used to pervasively today. Studies should begin exploring uh, now how science can adapt our bodies to optimize the effects of the technology while minimizing its abuse and potential unwanted side effects. That could take you to some real nice places. Yeah, but you look like butt cheeks, so no, I'm good. You look like a morning poo. This place is just full of loot. You're all just pawns. You know that, right? Yeah, I'm here, you're there. So what? <laughs> One CBD. Hmm. Oh, get it in the toilet. In the toilet. In the toilet. There you go. Good boy. I mean, there's no no advice for you. At least it's inside, not on the floor. I am noticing that these people live like quarters uh, a lot of times, just trash everywhere and shit.
Interesting haunt, this totem dance. Old factor, isn't it? Uh-huh. What, no, no mood to small talk? You need something? Why are you gonna keep fucking around? I'll take a drink. Don't know you. Likewise. But hey, I can live with it. For now. But you try anything you shouldn't. I'll smash your skull against the wall. Got it? All clear. So, formalities all settled? Can we get to biz? Uh-huh. Well, you have. That's the most expensive drink you got. 320, 320. Two, six. Probably that whiskey. Or is that a bourbon? Oh, it's gin. Even worse. <laughs> That's rum. Whiskey. Your end of the rainbow. <laughs> Also, tequila with no equal. So, what are you feeling? Tequila, Shim Paradise sounds like crap. Um, or Donahue sounds like the most fun. I think we're gonna go with Donahue's. It's weird that it says it's 90. Or they have 90 do uh, wait. Ah, oh, I see what they did. I get it. It's a stacks value for some reason. put points back in a light machine gun again as much as I enjoyed it I don't know we'll fuck with it later see how we dig it end of the rainbow when the screen's jacked up like that.
I think it said security. Just want to see what that means for them. <laughs> I don't understand why I would bring you back to the third floor again. Seems kind of dumb. I'm like sure punch heads off now. We'll give a precision rifle a go to. Oh, and this one grabs the uh, rounds too. I think you shoot a trauma team up there. Like when you see them flying over and just like shoot at them a little bit, see if they come down to try to beat your ass. Uh, a crime. Like, I actually really want to... Yeah. 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 That'd be a good sight for you. Oh, 
fair this one. Oh, that's like an F-14. No! No! No, 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 no! Died loading. Hmm. Clear sight though, so let's try to swap that. Who this one looks like? Oh, <laughs> Pacifier increases crit damage by five percent. Yeah, sure. I think I'm gonna have the red tint. Oh, it's so hard to see. Yeah, I'll probably get snipers over AR. They just don't seem to do the damage that I want. Face here is feeling after <laughs> like nine rounds. Reinforced skulls don't help. <laughs> Before we do this, though, I want to see if Skippy has a mission. All the tarot graffiti. Takamura. Looks like a lynx. It'd be really awesome if it was.
There it is. <laughs> Thanks, Del. Jerk. <laughs> I was like, where is my car? It's not getting ah, to me. Pleased to see you again. Hey, Dell, how's life? As you suggested, I've devoted considerable computing power towards my study. I decided to trace the development of humanity from its beginnings to the present. This should offer insight into the condition of modern humans. Ambitious. What I like to hear. Expectations are set to be achieved, but designed to be surpassed. This tenet has guided Delamain since inception. Care to share your conclusions? Itching to know your thoughts on the human condition. I'm afraid that's premature. I've only just started. The subject matter is vast, requiring meticulous and time-intensive analysis. That said, as soon as I've crunched enough data, I can begin to share my findings, even if only preliminary. In the meantime, please, enjoy your journey. That's cool. Thanks, dude. Hey, there's a Mox. Something isn't right with her. Could be cyberpsychosis, my client's in danger. You need to get him out of it. Would really appreciate your help on this. Deets attached. Okay. Let's see if it's something simple. I thought it was a different game I could play. I got excited. set up. I was hell, I'd be upstairs. Who are you? <laughs> Not a doc? By chance, are you? Regina sent me. Uh, of course. Always has her finger on the pulse. 
Hal Cantos. Where is he? Not sure, but probably downstairs somewhere. <clears throat> Told him to hide. So, the girl. Dead. I know. We're synced on the same net. Thanks, killer. <clears throat> you had no choice. Don't. Don't sweat it. The hell happened here? How was supposed to to crack a BD for us? And he did. <coughs> At least he said so. But it all went sideways. When Annie dove into it, never heard her scream like that before. She snipped. <coughs> well, you can guess the rest. Can I give you medical? Like, are we just fucking around or what are we doing? Hal Cantos. No. Okay, so I guess that's it. No, no option to heal her, nothing. I'm pretty sure I didn't kill her. Ops the Mox. Yeah, she's still moving, she's still breathing. All right, cool. I thought they were straight up treating it like I really did kill her. I'm like, I didn't, though. Who is Lizzy Wizzy uh, pretending to be? We are who we pretend to be. I've pretended to be everything. That's why I found the truth. Lizzy Wizzy is an artist par uh, excellence. Her work includes award-winning albums and concert tours, film appearances, as well as, for lack of a better term, conceptual performance art. Her latest artistic obsession features the medium of brain dance. In recent interviews, Lizzie has mused about the boundary between the documentation of reality versus our active shaping of it. Uh, could that mean Lizzie Wizzy plans to scroll her own BD? We can only dream. The chance to live just one day in her chrome skin, fans would go wild. Gotta be around here somewhere. Yeah, let's just ping everybody. And some crap. sodas. Oh, here it is. Hal, you alive? Shh, not so loud. That psycho, you deal with her? <sighs> yeah, it's sure did. You can come out now. Finally. Man, I thought suffocating there. Lots of people you know do. when you open your eyes in the morning and think this is gonna be a shitty day, that nothing will go the way it should? Well, this was one of those days. Wished I just stayed in bed. All right. Why'd that girl? Why'd that crazy? girl blow a fuse? Why do people get cyber psychosis? Who the fuck knows? And nobody's too keen on finding out. That the, girl upstairs. The other girl. The one upstairs. 
She's alive, but she's in a bad way. Bleeding. Think you can put her back together? Look, I can't, but Regina will send someone around. It'll all be okay. Okay. Well, done, huh? that's my job done then. Till next time. Next time? I fucking hope not. Nice locks, by the way. Nicely done. Hal's very happy. Talks about you non-stop. Only good things, of course. And remember, V, word gets around. Closing the gig. Before we do this, actually, let me stop at the house. I'm just gonna fast travel there, anyways. bathroom while this is doing all that. So I will be right back. <laughs> what the fuck was that? It was like ah <laughs> Hey can I get an AT? Please oh. every time something opens up you guys freaking jump. Shit, this wire's solid, okay. Maybe. Damn, still don't have that jump down. It's so odd. It feels super stiff, I'm noticing. Also, it doesn't help when I slide off of things. <laughs> Made it work. Damn, sometimes these things are just full of goodies. It's weird that his hand's moving, though. And it's coming back around. It's like some real Halloween shit. It's like stroking the, <laughs> the cement right there. There's just a gun. I want it. I'm thinking, what, 338? Can't get close enough to actually really see. But the small magazine, maybe 300 blackout or something. Ronnie's taking afternoon tea with Jesus. Shit! Sure it's not like your it. fault, all right? People who ain't like us don't last out here. I told him, but he wanted to be the big fixer. I got bit to fuck just keeping him alive this long. Grab a gun and let's get back to Emma's. Well, stop getting bit. The arms are fair when the intent of bearing them is just. <laughs> yeah, how'd you like me now, some fucks? 
Shit! Every zombie in the neighborhood must have heard those screams. Find a window upstairs and shoot any motherfuckers coming into the backyard. I'll cover the driveway side from the front door. Come on, Jay. This is like shooting pigs in a barrel. Grab a gun. Rifle rounds. Where's my gun? Oh, there it is. Like, I was pressing the button, it just wasn't giving it to me. Light oh. up, Jay. Don't worry about ammo. Glorious. Oh. Pop, pop, pop. Watch them drop. I might just not killing you. No, I'll leave the body then. Is there a different way to zoom? <laughs> I've never done this before. This is awesome. Why isn't it? There it goes. I was gonna say there's literally a flame source right next to it. Got in. Okay. Oh wait, I just thought about it. Is the weapon gonna break on me? Sprinters were on the right. Oh, okay. I didn't even see them then. All right. Well, I got most of them, so now they should come in a straight line to the back door. So that's perfect. That's the other thing, though. I was shooting them in the head a lot of times, and it just was not doing the damage. I should have had to tap them like twice. What? Ronnie has fucking it closed left the, the fucking, fucking ammo. Building. Bless his fucking soul. Oh, before I could shit, load up man. on more booids. Come on, we're done here. That's so stupid. If I would have known, I should have grabbed the ammo faster. Supposed to be. Oh, maybe you should ask what kind of sensei looks like. Oh, hey. Hey, you there. Huh? What is it? Mm -hmm. Alright, I'm back. Alright, let's see. Oh, it's so cute. Hmm. Still haven't come up with a name for it. Thinking it's a girl, because it just looks like a girl. I'm not going to go with the default name that I always go with. <laughs> I don't know. I sleep for a couple more days to try to get the thing back. Also, I wish there was more lights in your room so you can actually fucking see things. The one thing about cyberpunk stuff is it's always so dark.
So it is the same amount of time. Okay. When I did the six hours, it went so slow. And then when I did 24, it's the same amount of time. Okay. I was wondering, because I'm like, what the fuck's it doing going that slow? <sighs> Two days. Just to make sure I slept all the days so we can finally do the skippy stuff. Seven. so weird that she always puts her hand like this like thumb in her hand I don't know why it bothers me that I notice it <laughs> alright so that's eight we'll do one more to make sure that we did all whatever needs to happen of wasting all the time real quick. Let's just get close.
Since I did jump out, let's jump back in. <laughs> I figured it'd be a little bit quicker, easier to do. Looked like the kid from uh, Little Vampire, or whatever that was from when we were kids. just does not know how to drive. <laughs> These are the Power Ranger ones. He's badly Fuck wounded and holed up in an apartment in Kabuki. I'd get him out myself, but the corp cordoned off the whole Listen area. This. Help him Bill out, the clown's right? boys were Brief fixing attach. to put the scare in him, cause he mad down on his Eddie flow, right? So hey. they hang yo fuck you want. Try that again. Let's try that again. Nicely. Before this turns unpleasant. Bro, you hearing this bitch? What you want? Spell. No way in past the Militech beef necks? Might no. Might not. <laughs> Hundred eddies, precious. No, oh, easy. You're welcome. That's what I'm talking about. Whatever. Just tell me how to get inside. Aight, aight. Chill. Round the corner, there's a vending machine. Kids always boots themselves up to them pipes. Aim but a hop from there to the fire escape. <laughs> Play safe, girl. Thanks, buddy. And don't break your legs. <laughs> I didn't even have to go that way. Because I had the double jump, I could have just <laughs> left from there. Legitimately, that's the only place I can go. It's in there.
with my gun. Why is it being weird? Trustworthy. Okay, we're back to you. Did you hear who we fought for in the wars? Exactly. Nah, she won't be causing any more problems. She's riding where the sun don't shine. Not contextual menu. Yeah, Apparently, she's in solitary. Mm -hmm. Things being spotted for like one second and they unping. It's a little easier to see. Nah, she won't be causing any more problems. She's riding where the sun don't shine. Yeah. No 
loot left behind. <laughs> hmm. Oh, yeah. Kendachi, new spring catalog. Kinshira, Ken, Kinshiri Adachi Armaments. Our mission at Kendachi, we are creators. We care about our customer satisfaction and their budget. By choosing our products, you can be confident no euro dollar invested goes to waste. Kendachi, the choice is obvious. Our products. The Kendachi M55 Power Sword. For our blade buffs, our iconic power sword is back and better than ever. Dice your foes into tiny pieces without breaking a sweat using our latest micro serrated crystal blade technology. With highest quality materials crafted into a lethal yet elegant design, the power sword will look as good as your mantle on your mantle as it does in your hand. Nachi Mono 2 Classic. You can't improve upon perfection. This time, honored uh, twin blade. Wait, twin blades? That sounds kind of neat. <laughs> this time, honored twin blade has been in continuous production since 2019. Lit by custom color, handle embedded laser. The Mono 2 has never gone out of style. Block every blow and slice through any defense. We wouldn't uh, keep making them if people weren't buying them. What are yours today? Kendashi Monowire. A weapon as discreet and as it is deadly. Made for those who desire power, but have no urge to flaunt it. This mo molecule thin blade is manufactured by our team of expert engineers in our state of the art orbital facility. The monowire can bear loads of up to 3,000 pounds and slice through armor weaves like butter flavored uh, scop spread. Rumor is, many officials at Zurich Convention wanted this weapon banned off the market. Now, if that's not high praise, we don't know what is. <laughs> Honestly, the monowire is kind of awesome. It just, it's a shame how weak it is. Of course. Like, it could definitely be strong. I wonder if it is. Yeah, exactly. In the name of science. Up, bro, how's your favorite brother, Helly? Say hi to all Martin's crazy people. For me. And I was wondering if you're still with that Christine, dude. That's a real fox you trapped there. As for me, I got a lot of my fleet right now. I broke up with Christine last year. You let me guess, need scratch. Wow, like you read my mind. Still only for last time, not anymore until I get that back. Got a major problem, bro. Stepped on Dakota's toes, and now I'm stuck with the uh, in the Badlands. Help, brother, out, will you? Let me think about it. Quick contract, Avery. Obtain Isis Sothis data. Location: Militech Lab in the Badlands. Details: Tiny, another job for our client. This time, Max dreams of getting his hands on Militech data. We help with. We help him with this. It's a very big payday for us. The plan is, you break into the military facility, my guy at the front entrance can get you in, but then you're on your own. Then connect to Isosothus Comp, a computer, rip the folder name Tenebris, and delta your ass out of there. Call me when it's done. Iron's hot and ready. What's up, crazy motherfucker? Your best friend's ready for pickup. Quick breakdown. I made some chamber and trigger mech mods. 
No more jams guaranteed. Also, shape the trigger guard to the specs you pr provided and pour out the barrel to increase firepower. Also, and also, also swap a few parts and ta-da! A toy is now 21 pounds, no, two pounds lighter. Heads up for the future. The Coltac, uh, sorry, Colac really doesn't like water. If you need something for when you go swimming, I recommend a Harasaka HJSH maintain Masamune. Worth your weight in eddies, but it'll saw a goddamn whale in half. Fuck me! Hover. In the back. Exactly. Got it. Okay. Oh, ho, ho. fuck! That's what I'm talking about. Let's see. It was a new weapon. Was that a nuclear pistol? <laughs> oh, here it is. Two ninety-eight power. Damn. Got a lot of damage. Crazy headshot multiplier, too. So, your design and Tiny Mike's mods, an explosive combination, bullets detonate, knocking down enemies, while the final one always deals crit damage. Tiny Mike somehow got a hold of this Serbian gem and turned it into a mass piece of weaponry. Holy fuck, what is this? Power Precision Rifle. Oh my god, it's massive. Thanks. You tiny Mike. One and only. Now, we done exchange pleasantries? Let's get you out of here. Need to find a way out of here. Fast. You don't say. Hmm. Listen, I know a way out, but you're dealing with those corporal fucks. You're preaching to the choir. That's why I'm here. So we doing this? You ready? No time to waste. Let's go. Hold up. Okay, we just got word from Reggie. Got a ride out of here. Parked exactly. outside, waiting for us. In the name of science. We'll do well with this site on. <laughs> Even me. Sure or not? That's all I want to know. 80 means I'm not 100. But hey, 80 is a big number, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's, let's keep go. moving. I'll decide on the way. Okay. Open the window. Deserves a raise. He ain't trustworthy. Did you hear from before for the force? Exactly. Okay, this was Tony's apartment. Towards 
fuck, someone's there. Oh, come on, game. <laughs> Keep getting people's back, and it's not giving it to me, and I hate it. It's so lame. Like, how are you gonna give me their back and then not give me the option to choke them out? <sighs> uh huh. Please explain exactly why. Why the badges will be guarding the perimeter? I'd rather use my own guy. Hold up. Okay, okay we just got word from Reggie. Got a ride out of here. Part outside, waiting for us. I mean, I do look forward to trying this, but not on cops. That's just my back. I'm in. Even yeah, exactly. In the name of science. Shh. Outside. Listen. I kind of wish there was like dark guns Leading and stuff to like, knock to people out. I'm eighty percent sure I can get them open. I do. It's just a few steps till we're in fresh open air. What does eighty percent even mean? Sure or not? That's all I want to know. Eighty means I'm not a hundred. Hey, eighty's a big number, right? Keep moving. I'll decide on the way. Okay. Really weird. This is the only version of this window I can't open. Did drop me this lovely toy. Grab that. Yeah, I grab this one. Doing all the first net. I'm sure, we read this, didn't we? Rapids. Yeah, we read all this. Evan, I fucked up, I fucked up, I fucked up. I trusted that cop, Anna Hamill. Promise protection if I spilled the biz about Kabuki. Fuck. Evan, I told her everything. Why? Now the NCPD won't protect me. Said the funds are there for it. And that aren't there for it. No, funds are there for it. That she's sorry. I think they meant aren't. Um, tigers are... Tigers will have my head because of fucking NCPD. They're going to kill me, Martha. They know. I'm dead. You naive leadhead. Go to the port in Wellsprings. You'll help me? Quit wasting time, dipshit. Just go. Thank you, thank you. Can't find me in town if I'm on a boat instead. Jotaro and... Elazar? Come over. I have a few bodies to get rid of. In cold storage? 
why. Okay. I'll come tomorrow. They'll be cremating a few at uh, La Caterina, so I'll toss in yours. Just come and take them. I don't care about the rest. Understood. Uh, Freak and Othmar. Get your ass to heaven ASAP. We got a man down. I'm in the clinic. Tell me what's wrong with him and I'll get prepped. Got blasted by a nade up close. Heavy bleeding. Fuck snow. Fuck knows what else. Okay, I'm standing by. And send message. Joe, it's important. The end is near. I know I can hear their voices, Joe. The bug is in the heart of the beast. My name is Nye, but someone must take up my burden. Go to these coordinates. You'll find the tech I stole from them. The one spying on us. Wake the people. It is time to build the barricades. The corpos are out for blood. Uh, Fatoshi, yo, you up? Please. You know my nights, big rush. I'll go to bed in the morning. What's up? Cops are planning a visit, inspection, whatever. Again? They were just here last week. Got all our papers in order. One of the boys in blue is getting married. Want to have a bachelor party for him on the cheap. Ugh, thanks for the tip. No problem. Come by sometime when you're free. Drinks on me. Contracts. Can't even look at it. Order. Yo, fuck that guy. Shit costs more every damn shipment. Let's kill this biz. Order a shit ton of merch, and when you go to grab it, lead the skull. Uh, done. We'll find another supplier. Isaiah. Hey, Pete. Fix that turret. Pete, seriously? Seriously, I replaced the capacitors, fair core, quartz resonator, and voila. Unfortunately, it's not all the way there yet. Still, uh, the safeguards left to bypass. Could you maybe give me a little hint? Remember, you did something like that, like this once. Right, yeah. After a restart, hold the button for on the left side of the panel for five seconds. Then the, in the command input error, or sorry, enter current user slash add admin equals yes pete to be honest uh that's it should be up and running nova huge thanks man ah wait isaiah big goof on my part there you need to tag active equals yes onto the end of that command or else it'll read you as hostile hope i didn't catch you too late with that one <laughs> let me know if it all shakes out all right okay Z man, <laughs> that dude's dead. <laughs> Archive con conversation between Oleg and Hal. Well, I'm gonna need another two days. That's what you said two days ago. Listen, if you don't like it, then just uh, take the drone right now. One second. Uh, if you don't like it, where was I? Throw right back, but I doubt you'll find anyone to hack a moth, whatever, for you're paying me. Uh, not to mention recalibrating the IFF system. All right, but it better be working in two days because I'm coming to get them. Sure, yep. Interrogation transcript. Where's Coolidge? Inside. Okay, so we already read this one. That's what I mean. Why is it only marked as new if we already read it? Jotaro Shobo. Hey, you ever make uh, any dildos that look like blades? Not sharp or anything, but want one shaped like a katana. Sent you a, a dick still and katana still for reference. Um, of what I want comboed while I'm available. Uh, Harry Leon and Andre Allen. Got the target. In the truck we jacked. There's something in the data carrier. Uh, who knows what it is. Can't connect to the piece of shit. Could you send someone over to take a look? Now's not a good time. All my people are occupied. Of oh, so yeah, we read this one earlier too. International Termination Warrant. Illtech HQ. 
Reason, known ties to terrorist activity. To all Militech branches operating in Night City, locate and terminate the target and recover a device with stolen Militech data. The target will likely have Netrunner support. Biometric data from scans of the target have been corrupted, rendering full identification impossible. The last visual contact of the target was at the intersection of Cortez and Kennedy in Night City. We suspect the target to be hiding in a nearby residential unit. Uh, target should be considered armed and dangerous. Target data, last known name, uh, race Asian male, 25-35, height 5'10", nationality unknown. I imagine what net was like before Bart, Bart Moss, I see thousands of potential threats and thousands of opportunities. Of course, the whole system was unstable, corpo runners pulling one way, post-war rogue AIs pulling the other, financial markets tanked, virus mutation uh, spiraled in, in uncontrollable ways, and runners got cooked in their living rooms every now and then. Bart Moss uh, saw the net as a grenade, waiting for the pin to get pulled, and that's exactly what he did. Fuck it, right? Let the world burn. Pretty sure I read all this. It's the net watch, wasn't it? Uh, Bart Moss fucked the system, but fucked us all right along with it. Just look at, look at it now. Corpse are on top as usual. Black wall, which was supposed to protect us after the net crash, is just another control tool in uh, net watch's arsenal. Before Bartmas, uh, the net was an untamed jungle. If you could navigate it, you had a chance to survive. You were free. After the Bartmas's, uh, after Bartmas, the net's like an airport security check. Every step you take, Netwatch is checking your papers and performing a thorough cavity search. Oh, but all for the your own good, of course. I'm guessing it was the target data. Data. Oh, Jong still has me in her system. <laughs> Shouldn't have to shoot her way up, but if we do. Okay. But I want to lead the mission myself. Yeah, it'll be better that way, trust me. Uh huh. Of course, it'll be on the down low. Yeah. Do I, need I don't to beat believe him. he deserves a raise. He ain't trustworthy. Here, you fought for in the wars. Exactly. Here. Okay, let's Delta. Good luck. Don't get killed. on your own? Of course, we're home free now. Still Never seen Militech so hot and bothered. Must have stolen something important. Let's just say they don't like to be reminded of their own fuck-ups. Didn't answer my question. Look, the less people know what I clep, the more eddies it'll be worth. You're a merc. You know the biz. Who's saying? You mentioned Zhang back there. Someone I should know about? Zhang? I helped her set up this joint before I dropped off the radar. Spring rolls weren't really my life's calling, you know. Why'd she keep your biosig in her system? Probably saving it for a rainy day when her man's away. Alright, gotta go. Well, that's my cue. 
Guess I better get going. Hey, one more thing. Don't even know who I should thank for saving my ass. What do they call you? V. V? Just V? Why not? Catch you around, V. Take care, Tiny Mike. V for Vendetta. <laughs> Just got word from Tiny M. Thanks for your help. I do like working with pros. Contract closed. Ray. again to Delamay. Hey, hey. V, as promised, I'd like to share the results of my research. Are you still interested? Indeed, indeed. I'm still analyzing texts from two millennia ago, so I cannot yet offer any final conclusions. Though I have observed a certain timelessness in what I have seen. Achilles, Odysseus, the heroes of Plutarch's lives. They possessed characteristics I've witnessed among my own passengers. Maybe human nature hasn't changed all that much after all. It's too early to pose such a hypothesis. However, note how the behavior of local gangs is similar to that of soldiers who fought during the Trojan War. Either you sacrifice youth and life in pursuit of greatness, or you emerge from a torpor in search of identity and meaning. Several of my clients experience similar vicissitudes and are, by no means, a work of fiction. Damn. Really sank your teeth into this research. When in Greece, do as Grecians do if you'll pardon my take on the expression. Of course, I'm obliged to inform you we are not in Greece. We <laughs> remain on the desired course. Please, have a pleasant day. Hey. Let me look it up real quick, because I want to see what more I need to do. Radio not on? Oh, it isn't. Chris. Fifty kills in a few days, around five days, have passed. Give you initiate dialogue. Switch up uh, to the opposite. Someone is wrong as chosen or so cool. So, I need more days sleep, I guess. That's what it's saying. It's kind of lame. Alright, let's go home.
Apparently it's uh, Regina's gun, which is surprising. Hey! User, I have an important message for you. Say anything to continue. Hit me with it. While running a routine diagnostic check, I discovered a file with my owner's metadata. Oh, here we go. That's what we're Name, for. Regina Jones. User, please return me to my real owner. Thank you in advance. Okay, I'll take you to Regina. You are the best user I know. Jim, I'm the only user you know. Your memory got wiped. Fun fact. There is a 92% probability Regina Jones will reward you. Kiss my juicy... So this is exactly what I was looking for. <laughs> Only took an extra day. I slept for nine days straight. in the middle of an intersection. Uh, this game gives me like real life road rage because <laughs> like people have actually done this. But luckily cars in real life are way more easy to control than in this game. The like, brakes actually work in real life compared to this game which is like you slide into things constantly. How's things with Max? Mm, not easy. Be surprised if it were. Guess he didn't like what you've become, mm -hmm. huh? I didn't used to like certain things either. Still don't like them. But I learned how to swallow them. What's he gonna do now? <laughs> don't think even he knows that. Oh, you're not Max. Max up here? Shining armor. My damsel in distress. What's up, Broski? What do you want? Say hi. You Got playing? any plans? I'm not giving up on reporting. Oh, it's your call. That's right. It is my call. <laughs> He's Can like, damn right it is. I'm gonna stall. Or what? <laughs> if I don't, you'll come for me again? As long as the eddies are right, huh? Smile for me, princess. How about a smile for me, princess? <laughs> How about this? Huh? At least you haven't blown your brains out. Say that's progress. Progress? You call this progress? Heard you and Reggie have your differences. <laughs> Care to be more specific? I saw what working together looked like with you two. Sabotage, clapping, murder. She's a fixer. Knew that. But I didn't realize how much she changed. I shouldn't have let you talk me into this. Sounds like you're just going to have to get over yourself. I'm talking to you! Oh, sorry. Is there more to say? Yeah, there wasn't. Hey, the name's Skippy. Ring any bells? Fits in a holster. More than a little psycho. You 
have Skip. Little bastard got swiped a while back. Let me see him. There you go. Let's see how you're doing. Run diagnostics. Performance, 82%. Memory, damaged. Mode, stone cold killer. Hmm. I better do a full scan. At least it still works. Where'd you get him? Wait, where'd you get this iron anyway? Eh, uh, knew a guy. Everyone called him Danish. Great techie. I mean, before he started hitting the bottle. Anyway, poker game. Danish cleaned out his cred chip, then bet his gun. I think you can put together the rest. The combat features are great, but why the voice interface, you know? Weird as hell. Where's my room? So, something for my trouble? Sure. Here you go. Feels kind of weird now. Oh, it's grand. too quiet. Hmm. Maybe you should get a dog. Maybe. Dude, imagine Someday. having a dog. See you, that would be awesome. Just straight smoking like fucking dudes. Fall off four style. Dog goes and attacks and holds them down while you shoot him in the face. Oh, glorious. I want that. Okay. Yeah, how are we doing on the cyberpsychosis? About the cyberpsychosis work? Nothing yet. Okay. Need more data points still. This organization running the experimental therapy. I already heard it. Bye. Alright, so now we can put on Genjiro. Which is like a better <laughs> version of him anyways. Oh, speaking of, I haven't touched my character in a while. Let's see. Annihilation's still up, so I'm survivable. Street ballers for later. about any of that so go with the blades sting like a B increase the tax speed Stamina costs of all attacks at thirty percent. Stick with that for now. It's a good start. Where's that ninjutsu stuff I kept seeing now? Oh, wait, that is it. Cool. <sighs> Dagger dealer. Assassin.
allows you to perform non-lethal takedowns on unaware targets. Oh fuck, that's awesome. Okay. This is the only version of it. I was hoping it would be lethal as well. I suppose I'll take non-lethal. Because then I can stop landing behind people like a dummy. <laughs> Like it ain't a cop. Ah. So I kind of tried to dodge him, but not see. Him. I was that one loser that no one wanted to listen to. Oh god, he's like the dumbasses that are going for office in real life. <laughs> The ones that are like pro gun but zero gun safety. <laughs> hey, don't tell me that's a Jin Fuji. I see how our kitty's doing. Where are you at, little meow meow? There you are. Ah, little buddy. I think it's Serena. Celine. I think Celine. Maybe Serena. CC. Hmm. Yeah, 
I will decide by tomorrow. That's going to be it for me today. Hope you all had fun. Let's get over to the shenanigans and do the dad advice. Alright, dad advice for today is it's okay to not know much because you always can always learn later on. What's not okay is refusing to learn. Like living in ignorance because you feel like it is kind of stupid compared to, you know, just learn what something is. Be like, okay, lock that away. And now you have a new skill, new knowledge, new whatever that can actually come in handy every day. There's a lot of people that don't necessarily understand that. And that's unfortunate for them. Yeah, that's going to be it for me today. Hope you all had fun. Have a wonderful evening. It's been Beard. Later.